Um, you have a new super yeah. auto, a very super, super oh, auto man. to share with me. Yeah. What, what do you have on deck? Well, somebody said, go check out that Krups in the kitchen mm -hmm. that we were using as a, you know, as a demo to test before we actually put it in on our lineup. Yeah. And I'm like, oh, okay. There's another super All auto. All right. <laughs> well, it's the Krups EA9000. And this Bam. thing almost does laundry. <laughs> I am telling you, I have never seen a super automatic that does quite like this machine does. Okay. So just in the in the initial programming, mm -hmm. you can program eight different drinks, and you can program eight different people. Okay. So within my drinks, I only have two programmed right now. I get add in another six drinks. Holy cannoli. Yeah. Milk-based drinks or just uh, ristretto, cappuccino. Or, uh, just coffee only. Coffee, yeah. Okay. So <laughs> let me let's show you. Modify. Oh, no, I didn't oh, say no. I wanted it. No, go no, back. No, no, no. Let's it's go gonna, back. Okay. Let's go back. So you do modify first? Modify, okay. then cappuccino. I can change the ounces of milk uh, in the... In the product itself. What's it doing? Okay, two ounces up to 3.3. .3, and it knows it's a cappuccino, so it's not going to go up any higher. Okay. It's not like an Americano. You can change the seconds that it actually preheats the milk. And this, you'll see the steam arm later. It goes down into the milk mm -hmm. and preheats it. At 20 seconds, way hot. Mm -hmm. I can tell you, way hot. And then frothing for 10 seconds. If I was to run this up, which I tried it, I ran it way up. Oh, my God, it torched. <laughs> it, was, it was the hottest. You can make the hottest drink on the market. With Galding. This. Yeah. So okay. I'm take it back down. I don't even remember where it was. but I'm yeah, We're at 20. 20. I'm going to take it down to 2 ounces. And then frothing. I think I had it a little bit higher, but right there. Okay. And then you go, Okay. Okay. And then you can go to the amount of coffee that is dispensed uh, uh, as far as you can Your change actual it. Java. Okay. Yeah. And then beans, if you don't want it real strong. And this automatically adjusts the grind, the fineness of the grind for each drink and oh. the amount that's being dispensed. Nice. You don't have a grinder adjustment back in here like you do in most machines. It automatically adjusts the grind okay. and the dosage. Got it. And it's your bean hopper, which holds uh, half a pound. Half a pound. Yep. And then also, um, along with this, comes a, while we're in the bean hopper, mm -hmm. in your welcome kit, they have a cover that goes in there. If you're using an oilier bean, you put this in here. And I haven't used it yet, so I'm not sure exactly how it goes. I think something like that. Anyway, I haven't put it in yet. But what it does is it makes it so that the beans will flow better down through into the grinder if you're using an oilier bean. Oh, so they don't get stuck up in the hopper. And, mm -hmm. Okay. Like you have most. to shake the machine. Do, do, do. Oh, yeah. you got to have a little monkey sitting here. Around. Exactly. Right. And, or a small child. And a welcome kit. They give you filters for the um, um, water. They give you a water filter, which we already have it in here. Here's the water tank over here. About 50 ounces of water. Okay. It has a the magnet in it, so it gives you an alarm when you mm -hmm. run out of water. It gives you cleaning tablets. It gives you descaling stuff. It gives mm -hmm. you a needle to clean out the tip on the steam arm that we're going to see here in a minute. And it gives you an applicator to put your water filter in. Okay. Okay. So... Okay. So we got beans up top, water on this. Do you know how big the water tank is there? 50 ounces. 50 ounces? Yep. I measured it out. And then about, what's on the... About 50 ounces. What's on the left side? Because that Over door here. opens too. Yeah. Dregs box. Oh, okay. It holds a lot of dregs because the people in the kitchen and their place have been using it and not emptying it. And so I come in and it's like right up to here and I'm like, oh, okay. Oh, okay. Let's get rid of this bad boy. <laughs> up here also, the steam arm that you're going to see in a little bit, This, they give you two of these. Uh, this is a liquid that clean that uh, actually cleans the steam arm. It, oh. has, a, it has a regular steam arm, and okay. this is like a Rinza, similar to that I product. See. Well, it's a Krups product, and it's all prepackaged the right size. So you just swap them out. Yep. And you take it so out like that. Take it off. I'm not going to take it off, but you take this off when it's empty, and it's getting down there. Yeah. Okay. We'll go. We'll go through <laughs> the whole process, up and down mm -hmm. on the spouts. It has a small drip tray that comes out 
It has a larger drip tray, and then it has this smaller one like this that comes out. This one does just oh, the front. Oh, okay. This one does the whole machine itself. And, and you could. Is, you can put a yeah. towel cup. That's nice. the, one of the beauties of that coming out. But it also does um, the spouts adjust, too? Go up and down? Yeah. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> cool. There we go. Okay. There is so much to this machine, it's hard to... Keep it all straight. It, it, it really is. Ristretto. Okay, open the ground store. Mm -hmm. You can open it. Oh, so it sort of did a little unlock. Yep. Okay. You can't open it until it... You see this area in there? There's a little There's a little stop at the bottom. Oh. You can only put in that much ground coffee. That's nice. <laughs> it's one scoop, and the scoop is in the door here. So it's all set up for you. So you don't have that, like, we've had people who, like... Fill, fill up. up there, thinking yeah. that it's going to slowly no, dose stuff out. No, 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 so no, this no. keeps you honest. This keeps you honest. And then you shut it, mm -hmm. and then start. And we're not going to start it right now. And okay. right now we have it at 0.7 ounces for a ristretto. You can change it, too, see, on the fly. Okay. It's very interesting. So these are all the drinks you can do. Now we'll get into some of the other settings. You can change your language. You can change your brightness. We've got it up pretty bright. Okay, date and time, because you can actually have this come on in the morning. There we go. Now you know what day it is. <laughs> you didn't know before, did you? <laughs> on and off. You can set it to go up to two hours uh, before it goes off in 15 second intervals. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got it up to two hours. Volumes and units, uh, milliliters or ounces. Water hardness, it's, they give you a water test strip, and there's four different settings you can choose. You test your water, and then choose appropriately for what uh, the how hard your water is. Okay. Let's see, I can tell we didn't do it. Level zero. Hmm. Uh, coffee temperature, and I'm telling you, when it's on hot, it's hot. Okay. It's very hot coffee. And then demo mode. And those are just the factory settings. Oh, got it. Okay. okay. Okay, let's go back now to info. It will tell you how many drinks it's done. Look at it. <laughs> it's crazy. Mm -hmm. Which is kind of nice. Hot drinks. And others. With hearts. Yeah. Okay. Automatic descaling. We're not going to get into that. The rinsing. But you have a whole maintenance story yeah. here you can yep. do. Yep. Yep. Uh, cleaning model, which is that bottle up in there. Mm -hmm. You know, the manual cleaning of the, well, show, Well, you know, I'm not going to show you that until we show you our drink <laughs> and how this thing works. Okay. Then we'll get into that. And then service. You can actually, um, you can take the, you can take this out. Oh. And clean it. The bypass chute. Got it. But nice. you can't do it unless you, you tell it that you want to do it. Mm -hmm. Okay, rinse it. It tells you every move to make. Put it back in. Grammy, you know what? I don't think you need the user manual for this machine. You got it. <laughs> Guess what? I did read it though. Oh. No, you know, I looked at the pictures. <laughs> It, it was a little light reading for you. Mm -hmm. um. So we're going to do a cappuccino. These are the factory settings. You can do a small one, which is 6 ounces, or a medium one, 8 ounces. Large is 10. Okay. But we want a small. Okay? Right? Start. Put 2 ounces of cold milk in your favorite glass. Okay? We measured it out. <clears throat> Cat made me measure it. And a beaker. I like this. You're going to have to, at some point, get down here, I too. Know. Okay, place under the snow. Okay, place. it tells you everything. <laughs> Get up in the morning. <laughs> Preheating. Preheating. Yep. <laughs> yeah, you're gonna see how this works. Look, there's the steam arm. seems counterproductive to me, but whatever. It's filming it right now.
you're going to see that steam arm come up out of there. <laughs> it goes back at some point. We'll see that in a little bit. It's going to start making the coffee here in a second. Please wait. Oh, well, it went back. We missed it. That's okay. Steam nozzle movement. Yep. This thing has a mind of its own. So we could lower that if we wanted to. But we don't have to. Pre-infusion. Hmm. Brew. And at any time you can stop it up here too if you want to interrupt it. If you're like, okay, too much coffee or too, yep. okay. Looks pretty. I'm going to let you taste it because I have a bit of a cold and I have a lozenger in my mouth. It's like, I, that won't taste like coffee at all to me. Hot, huh? <laughs> really hot. Yeah. We should have brought a thumb wow. over here to stick it in it, but I'm telling you, these are the wow. hottest hot drinks. That's really hot. I mean, I burnt my tongue. Yeah, see, in the settings, I put it up hot when I was first playing with mine. Mm -hmm. I had to take it way back. That's good, though, because usually with these kinds of things, it's, you know... Not hot enough. Okay, so this is tight, Gail. Okay, so the steam arm <laughs> lives right back here. Yeah. After it gets done, it goes down into this vessel, which it's, do it's done its thing already, mm -hmm. and it's going to fill up with water and rinse it. Yeah. And it's Typically, though, it would have gone back in there had you just left it. Yeah. Said no. Would have gone back in there, would have filled up with water, rinsed it, and then that water goes down into the drip tray. Oh, okay. So that it just does a little automatic clean each time. Each time. Now you can you can get into the at a certain point it's gonna ask us if we want to do the in-depth one and this and that's when that is it in puts play. some of this down in there and it takes about five minutes. Got it. It takes longer. But All it's, right. a, it's a more thorough cleaning like Rinzo does. So this is the super 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 automatic. Oh. <laughs> it's like, what does this thing do, right? No so, laundry, though. I didn't notice any uh, uh, wash and rinse cycles. On with the, the rinsing of this, with every milk, the yeah. only thing is you do get a lot of liquid down in here. So you have this to be is, careful. This, is, this was empty when, I, when we started. Yeah. So you'll have to empty this more often. Uh, the water tank's plenty big. You don't have to worry about that. Mm -hmm. The Drake's box is plenty big. You don't have to think about that. That's the one cup we just made. Mm-hmm. Cool. Scoop. I dig it. See, it's telling me. Empty the ground. All right. So that is yes. the EA9000 by Krups, the super, super, super automatic. Is this your is this your new machine, Gal? Are you going to buy um, one? You know, one of the employees just asked me. One out of ten. <laughs> Where do you rate it, Gal? Yeah. And I said, well, honestly, I'll give it an eight. An eight. I'll give it an eight because of the quality of the, the coffees and the milk drinks. Okay. It's a little more latitude than others that it's a little bit hotter. Mm -hmm. um, I am concerned about how long is that mechanism going to last. Yeah. And then I think what takes it back a bit for me, too, is the overall appearance. You don't like the look of it. I would like to see more stainless and a little higher end look. And then yeah. I think this machine probably takes it home. Takes takes that portion of it home anyway man <laughs> cool i mean it's, it, it's amazing until you try this mm -hmm. you, like she was saying it is hot mm -hmm. yeah I, I totally burnt my tongue my tongue is like it does not well, have to be that hot though you can kick it back so you have you have choices too hot too hot baby thanks gail you're welcome